what's going on fellas I am uh, currently driving home from work well not really home or I'm gonna head to the shop first meet my dad that way we can uh, he's gonna load up the car trailer and go pick up his car from my buddy's house uh, he blew the motor up uh, dropped the valve at the beginning of the summer and destroyed a cylinder wall so well, his car's pretty much been we had a stock 350 in it just driving around but no fun to race with so uh, currently he was in the process of building another motor he has currently got it done so we need to get the car from his house from my buddy's house to his house and start putting the motor in that way we can uh, possibly go out and have some fun this weekend and probably knock a few off I'd imagine uh, I also am loaning my converter to another one of my buddies I have a 4500 freak show and he's gonna use it and uh, hopefully he'll have his car back together now for this weekend as well it should be a fairly easy swap so I figured I'd get some footage of what's going on and the cars and yeah we'll see how it goes well I uh, made it up there just in time they already got it out of the gate and loaded it up I didn't even have to help them do anything the type of work I like to do right there the type of work that you don't have to do much work at all uh, we're gonna get out here to the get over here to the house my buddy's house throw up the car and we'll be back with some more videos and just a few minutes Yeah, the guy that called him out here, here doing all the leg work. It's on there. Nothing special, just a street car. Jason says he's dragging ass tonight, this weekend, especially his. Say hi to YouTube, Mom. Hi, YouTube. That guy, he's just fucking ugly. <laughs> well, the old Nova's in the shop here. Go over here and turn the lights on. A little bit of a mess, but... Sorry, don't mind that part. There she is. Ready for the motor. 
we get her put in there tomorrow. So, this right here is my wife's truck. Just first gen S10, four nine inch cow tracks, uh, put new suspension under it, control arms, uh, just some um, motor speedway uh, control arms, and uh, uh, just stock lowers, trick springs, uh, new spindles, all move steering components. I got manual gearbox. All the parts that are sitting on it are actually all Camaro parts off of this car here. So, uh, this is my buddy's car that uh, did have, we did put the motor out of this car into my dad's Nova there for a little bit. And then, uh, while basically while I was fixing this car, because we had to do a little bit of repair where the spring mounts, the perches go to the car, was... Uh, riding out of this car so did a little bit of work here had to do this side as well so we got that all fixed up have to do uh, uh, dry shaft hoops and uh, we modified the uh, frame connectors on this car to make them better because they were just barely making it and then uh, also working on this cutlass right here. This year's Noseville motor. Been working on this for probably about slowly throughout the year, buying parts here and there. This ain't my car. This is actually a buddy, another buddy of ours. Pretty much only work on buddies' cars, I guess you could say. So it's got all wheel wood brakes, tubular control arms, uh, coilovers on it really nice car will be definitely will be a really nice car dyno matted all the interior piece of aluminum to block off the back you know, fuel systems done cam just finished up the fuel system in the car today well last night shall I say uh, I think he has to run one more hose other than that it's pretty uh, pretty much done Real, it'll be a real nice car when it's done. And then actually, I have another cutlass in the shop right now that I am going to be doing a frame notch on. And that's all this car needs, the frame notch. But this car here is really nice. It, uh, all the original interior inside this car. I mean, it's a real clean car. Really well built car. Uh, actually, Cam built this car before, um before we started doing the stuff up here at the shop so really nice car can't wait to get it back out on the road that's for sure but <clears throat> well I'm gonna head home well it looks like uh, probably gonna end the night here just got home uh, I polyurethane my wife's cornhole boards that she's making for someone did the back sides for her. that way the People can come pick them up tomorrow. Uh, it looks like uh, we took my dad's car back to the shop, unloaded it, and I'm gonna work on it tomorrow because how late it is. He has to work and I have to work too. So probably going to uh, get out of work tomorrow, help him button up whatever needs to be buttoned up. And then uh, I have to do a anti roll bar tomorrow for a buddy on one of his cars we didn't get to uh, last weekend due to cash days so we'll see how it goes we'll see if we get it done this weekend but uh, that's gonna be it for tonight and we'll see y'all tomorrow